Welcome back, folks, to more Let's Play the PDC World Championship Darts Pro Tour. In the last episode, we won the European Championship. Now it's time for our final tournament here, and how fitting we start our final tournament the same way we started the first tournament, with a battle against Mark Dudbridge. Alright, so I'll remember first, this is a double in. 5-0-1. Uh, best of five legs, best of three sets. Let's do this. Our best of three sets, so it's only two sets. Oh, jeez. Okay, this video could be shorter than I thought. Yeah, we ain't seen him in ages. You're right, Mark Dubbridge. How you doing? Like the first guy to be a victim of me. God, I remember you from so long ago. Well, you actually got the treble. You actually got the, uh, the double. Fair play to you. We're also very close to uh, Phil Taylor's number one spot in the order of merit, and... Once we get that number one spot, the Let's Play ends on oh, nice. No, it does. There's nothing else that we need to do. This is the final tournament. And, uh, yeah, this is the final tournament. All we need to do now is win this tournament and uh, become number one in the order of merit. And uh, this Let's Play ends. So, yeah, we're getting to the home stretch now. Mark Dubbridge is actually playing pretty well so far. He's gotten better since uh, in over a year since the last time we fought him. Good old Dudbridge. I've probably gotten worse in comparison, but regardless, it's been a long day for me. Ugh. I'm hoping to at least get a couple more videos done today. Maybe maybe two. It's 20 to 10 at night at the moment. Uh, I do have work tomorrow, but I don't have to be there until 10 o'clock in the morning. So I'm good. I can do probably two videos today. Maybe two tomorrow. Depends. But uh, yeah, I guess we'll see. Under from Mark Dubbridge, so we need at least an 80 to uh, to get onto an out first. And we are going to be on an out first. Before Mr. Dudbridge. A 101 out. Which, again, very possible. Very possible indeed. Dudbridge, on the other hand, is now on 101. And is on 81 for an out. Okay. 19, treble 18, double 14, if I wanted to do that. Let's go treble 19 to kick things off. 4 leaves double top. Let's try 14. I should not have done that. That leaves me one of my least favorite doubles in double 15. Got it, though. All right. That was good. I'm just happy I got double 15 there. All right. Nice. Right, second. I need to remember again that I need to double in. Oh, I barely got it. I thought I missed it for a minute there. Oh, I didn't miss that one either. Right. A 160 to kick off in the second leg of the first set. Pretty good. Dudbridge misses his first dart. And the second. He's giving me the advantage now. Give me over a two a dart advantage by hitting only 40 in his first three darts. Good first dart there from me. Good second dart from me. Could this be my first 180 in this tournament? Yes, it is. And that leaves me 161 to out on. Which is annoying, but doable. Dudbridge, on the other hand, not playing very well at all. He's still stuck on 436. 435, ouch. This is going to hurt then. All right. Treble 20 is first up. Treble 17. Missed it. Oh, well. Oh, well, never mind. He's on 435, so I apologize if I don't feel threatened at the moment. You had a much better run last time round. Like in the last leg, you done a lot better that time. So that's 21 Thank so you. far. Ah, nice recovery there, Mark. Nice recovery. Still doesn't mean I'm not going to be able to hit this double 12, though. Because, spoiler alert, I am. Second leg goes to me. One more leg and we are halfway there. With our, uh, with our best of three sets. First of two sets there. Mark missing the first double. 
Hits the second though, so we, so he's only got a two. Ooh, but that's a that's a good score on two darts. On two darts, he couldn't have done any better there. Good first dart from me. That first missed dart though, I am not gonna let it slide. I am gonna take advantage of it completely. One sixty to kick off. Very nice. Thudbridge needs something now. That's not going to do it. Six. Right, we've immediately caught up in three... Just three darts, we've immediately caught up. And actually now have the advantage. Good first dart there from me. Good second dart as well. Going for another 180. Thank you very much. I shall take that. Yes. All right. Things are looking good. Possible nine data in the wings right now. While Mr. Dubbridge is still stuck on 296. Right. Treble 20 is first. Missed it anyway, so bugger me. Hit the second one anyway. Uh, let's go 19. See what we can get here. Well, we can get 19. So there we go. We're on 62. There's a lot of things I can do there. One is not getting double, uh, treble one. Well done, mate. That's better. 18. Dude's a bit late to try and stage a comeback now in this set. Treble 12 leaves double 13. I do not abide by your rules. Double 10 is needed now for me. It's a simple enough double. There you go. First set goes to me. Good start altogether. And it's my turn to throw. So remember, it's double in. There we go. First dart goes in. Perfect dart. Good second dart as well. Third dart. Also in. 160 to kick off. Good start altogether. Come on, Mark. What have you got? That's nowhere near it. That's too near it. Go a bit higher. Nope, he misses all three. And in fact, it's five. Which doesn't count because he hasn't doubled in yet. Good first dart from me. Second dart. Also good. I thought I missed that for a minute there. Barely got in. Yes, and got the third as well. Possible double in nine darts are coming up. He missed again. He hit the one. Ah, do you know what, for a minute there, I thought, could I hit a double in nine dar with him stuck on 501? That would be fun to do. It would probably never happen, but still, it would be fun to do, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? Be, be enjoyable. Treble 17 is next. Got it! Bullseye for the nine dart finish in double in. Yes! Nine dart finish for me. I'll take that. Very, very nicely. <coughs> All right. Oh, we hit it first time this time. All right. We could have a difficult leg here. We could, if he could actually aim better. Go on, lower. No. Not lower. And how does lower sound like to the right? Seriously, mate. The hell. All right. Good first dart from me. Good second dart from me. I'm going to go 17s here. Gonna try and get the 17 out of the way now. Nice. 151 leaves 350. So far, good first start there from Dudbridge. That less good. Still has the lead, but it's not much of a lead. We could do a double whammy here. Uh, we could get another 9 dar finish. And we could get the highest out as well. We could do both. Yes. Right, consecutive nine darts coming up in double in. That would be really nice, wouldn't it? That would be very nice. That's good funny for me, actually. All right, come on, Mark. No, Mark. No. All right. Treble 20. First up. Got it. Treble 20 again. Oh, missed it. Ah, well. 
Well, I'll get a 140 here and get double top. That's a shame, but oh well. It's a bit of a shame. Right. Ah, oh, come on, Mark. Actually, no, it's not double top. It's Oh, no, not 15 again. No! Not 15. Ugh, I'll give it a go. Why not? I'll give it a go. I mean, it's not like Mark Dudbridge is actually going to catch up, is he? He's not. Right. Let's give one of my least favorite doubles a go. Double 15. Well, never mind, I got it. Nice. Right, possible final leg already. Already. Could be the final leg coming up. All right. First dart goes in. Second dart goes in. Let's try 17s again. Let's see if we can get that out of the way now. Yes. 151 to kick off. Good start. Dudbridge, on the other hand, not as good of a start. Right, we have a 51-point lead so far in what could be, probably will be, the final leg. Good first start there. Yeah, looks that looks like it's in. That's definitely in. 180 coming up. Yes! All right, we're on again. We're on for the 9-dart finish, plus the highest out in the game of darts. Dudbridge may be looking for a different record himself. No, he's not. Ah, oh, well. Looks like uh, Alan, Alan still has the record for lowest score with three darts when you're not on an out. Oh, well. First treble 20 goes in. Second treble 20 goes in. Bullseye! For not only another 9 dart finish and double in, but also the highest out. Yes! And with that, it is over. We have won. We have defeated Mark Dudbridge with a 147.84. Pretty good. 5 150s there. Or oh, 5 180s there. Uh, 10 140 pluses that weren't 180s. And only 3 100s. Pretty good. Mark Dudbridge is, did not get a score higher than 140. With a 72.26, that's pretty shoddy, Mark. Come on, mate. Pretty shoddy. Pretty crappy, that was. Pretty bad. All right. Without the way, we are through to the round of 16. Who else is through? Ronnie Bax is out. Colin Osborne goes through. Barney is out again. No, not Barney. Why does Barney always go out? So Simon Willock is through. Mark Walsh defeats Kevin Painter. Phil Taylor's through. No one is surprised. Beat Steve Beaton. We've got Mervyn King versus James Wade. Andy Hamilton versus Colin Lloyd. Dennis Priestley versus uh, Adrian Lewis. Gary Anderson versus Toon Grebe. I don't know how to pronounce that. Toon Grebe. Toon Grebe. And we have got Colin Osborne. Best of five legs. But uh, best of five legs. Best of five sets. So, first of three sets is the winner. And folks, apologies for the uh, for the short video here. But in the next episode, we will be having a big bumper video. Us in the round of 16 against Colin Osborne. Nine legs could do it and win us a place in the quarterfinals against, obviously, Phil Taylor. I mean, come on, you know. And then, since we're in Ireland, we're going to get drunk. Because, ha, stereotypes. Hey, anyway, I like to get drunk as well. The English are known for it. Anyway... Enough of that. Next episode, the battle with rank number 12, Colin Osborne. I'll see you then.